What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Lump Vision. I go by the name Lump, D Lump, or LV. It doesn't matter what you want to call me, I'll respond to you in any of them. Before I get started, I'd just like to thank all of my subscribers, old and new, and everybody who comes by and watches my channel. Today, I just want to do a really, really quick video. Uh, I just want to talk about this uh, this year business, okay? Um, I saw the homie Sean P. I watched his video yesterday, and he was hesitant on trimming his beard because um, for when I got, if I'm wrong, Sean P., please jump in the comments and let me know if I'm wrong. Um, from what I got, basically, um, when if he trims his beard, it no longer becomes a year. Like, because when you grow your year, you just grow it out. You don't do anything, no trims, no anything like that. You just you just grow it out for a year, and then I guess after that, you decide what you want to do with it. And he was back and forth on whether he wanted to trim or not, because I felt like Sean was like, oh, it's no longer a year anymore. And I say, forget that, man. There is no right or wrong way to grow your beard. You do whatever the hell you want to do <laughs> to your beard. I understand that a lot of times when uh, when a bearded brother say don't trim your beard, it's just like a it's like a it's like a, a push to keep on growing, you know, a push to just, just keep growing. So I understand there's a lot of positivity behind it. But at the same time, I don't want people to feel like uh, they're not doing something the right way if they don't follow whatever supposed guidelines there are. All right. Uh, the one thing that I learned over the course of growing my beard is there's you have to figure out what works for you. OK, what works for me may not work for you. The way I do my beard, the things that I do to my beard may not be the things that you should be doing with your beard. But at the same time, it may work out for you. If I show you a tip or trick or another uh, YouTuber shows you a tip or trick and you use it and it works, run with it. You know what I mean? So don't think that there's one way to do this. One of my favorite videos is my video that I did on uh, beard don'ts that I do. There are some, uh, there is some science behind some of it on using certain tools or doing certain things a certain way. There is some science behind it, but at the same time, science is just trial and error. When scientists are running their experiments, you know, if they use a hundred, they do it a hundred times, it may or may not work. You know, it may work 50 times out of the hundred or it may not, you know what I mean? It may it's a trial and error thing. So this this is constantly trial and error. Um, unless you find something that's working for you. If it's working for you, there's no need there's no need for you to continue to 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 run a trial because it's working. If it stops working and then it then becomes ineffective, now it's time to make a change. All right, effective and ineffective, but not right and wrong. All right. So this is basically me talking to Sean. It's talking to anybody out there who wants to make a move with their beard that they feel like it'll be in the best interest for the way or, uh, the way they want their journey to go, all right? Make the move based on how you feel, not on how the community views it, if that makes sense. But like I said, it's like 99% positive when it comes to this thing here. So I don't want this to seem like it's a negative video. I just want to encourage you to do whatever you want to do. OK, so uh, I've been there. I didn't want to trim. Uh, I've done multiple trims because it gets wiry and, you know, not full looking. So I got to make a move, you know, so if it continues to grow and stays full, then I'll keep it at that length. But as soon as this starts to look like it's not full and the hairs and the see through done, I'm, I'm trimming it. Get it out of here. OK, so I'm not going to you know, prolong this thing here. I just want to keep encouraging you on you know, going with your journey the way you want to go with your journey. And that's it. That's all I have to say about that in my Forrest Gump voice. <laughs> that's it. I hope you all have a good day. All right. Questions, comments, concerns. Let me know later.